fitness.com, the place where it all happens. Well, at least where I make food sometimes, and occasionally when the sun's shining correctly and all the birds line up in a row, my wife cooks. Anyway, I got me some Super Pump Max thing. As far as Super Pump Max, you know, I used it back when it was only Super Pump. Now, the recommendations here are take one to three scoops. So, of course, I'm going to take, you know, I'm going to take three of them. So, here we go. Big scoops. Okay, got it going on there. Boom. Okay, got my Super Pump. Now, Super Pump, it has some real good ingredients in here. Uh, l taurine calcium, uh, <laughs> glycer glycerophosphate, uh, <laughs> sesame, which is a glutamine type product, diamagnesium malate, potassium phosphate, citrulline, carnipure, L-carnitine, -car L-tartrate. L -tar L -tar got some branch chains in there, two grams of leucine, and then it has L-isoleucine, L-valine, L-valine, creatine, um, tyrosine, caffeine. I mean, this is an old... You know, it's a straight-up formula. It promotes skin-tearing muscle pumps and explosive workouts. Okay, that's my pump and energy run, blend right there. Next, I'm going to put in some carbolic. Got the TerraSport in there to rush nutrients into your cells. For pre-workout, I usually roll with a half a scoop. Boom. That always poofs up like that, man. I need to clean up. And that will be part of my pre-workout. I'm also going to throw in some of this vanilla. MTS Nutrition Way, because I find vanilla goes a lot better with the uh, flavors of the uh, pre-workouts. Just about 10, 10 grams of whey or so, just about. Put that up there. Got that going on. Shake it up. Ooh, ooh, we're shaking up. Okay, got that going on. Going to throw in some vasotropin. I was telling you guys about this the other day. I like this as a pre-workout pump product, and really, in pill form, Hemavol comes in pills too, but vasotropin might be something you all want to try. It's a damn good product. Um, it's got a little bit more of that Terra still being in there, like the Terra, the Terra Sport in, um, in Carbolic, so that's going on. Walk out. Yummy. Alright, size on. I need a little extra carbs. I'm small. I want to get fat. No, carbs are good. Um, generally speaking, I, I got a bad rap for being anti-carb. Um, I did write a book called The Carb Haters Anonymous Diet. I could have contributed to it. But here's the bottom line. When you're dieting, no, I don't believe in carbs around workouts. I believe you should get your carbs from micronutrient-dense foods throughout the day in your diet. But when you're bulking or even maintaining, if you're going to get in fast-acting carbs, get it in around training. I like getting it in there so your body's in its most absorptive state, so to speak. Will it amount to anything too great? Maybe, maybe not. Will it hurt? No. And if you need extra calories like I do, there you go. I was going to throw in a scoop of Modern BCAA by USP Labs. Also in fruit punch flavor. Because I like that there, BCAA. Post workout, Cell Tech MTS Nutrition Way. There I go. Today is chest day. <clears throat> Today is chest day. Chest day is a wonderful day for me. It's my best body part by far. Um, I'm willing to admit that. And, uh, you know, today I'm going to crush it. I want to go pretty heavy. My shoulder's been bugging me the last few weeks. Feeling a lot better now. I've been working on my flexibility. So the bottom line is, I'm ready. I feel great today. Um, yesterday's workout was a bit off. Um, the video you probably saw the other day of me doing um, doing some uh, hamstring training. The day after that, I did trampoline. And that was the day before leg day. I just felt lapped yesterday because I'm not used to, you know, many, many, many minutes on a trampoline. It's like high-intensity cardio that doesn't stop. And doing legs after jumping on a trampoline was a bit whack. But I'm all recovered and ready to roll today. And um, that's good to go. Also, if you're all looking for, uh, if you guys like deaspartic acid, um, Muscle Tech does have a product called AnnoTest on the market. They sent me one of these. Um, has a full dose, uh, 3,120 milligrams of deaspartic acid, LCLT, which is alternative L-tartrate. -tar has some boron in it, and then it also has some, um, you know, aminos in there: glutamine, leucine, valine, and isoleucine, along with some B6, zinc, B12. It's a pretty good all-in-one formula. I got the fruit punch flavor here, and uh, then I'm gonna give it to my buddy Van, and we'll do um, we'll do a little test on him. If it can prevent him from losing muscle mass, being that it just had a baby like two days ago, then it works. So we'll do some. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll have him try it out and give his opinion on that. Other than that, ready to roll. Mark Lowbinder, TigerFitness.com. Peace out. All right, time to get warmed up, baby. Time to get warmed up. 3:15. Man, I'm feeling good today. My shoulder's been aching me forever. 
and um, something was wrong with it. I don't know if I pulled something, tore something, I don't care. Anyway, it felt really good today. I, was able to, I felt with 135, okay, this could be a good day. This is 365 right here. Three plates and a quarter on each side. You always got to hit yourself in the head beforehand. See my boy Morris in the background rocking it out, just making sure shit don't fall on me. Look at that. Boom. Pause. Boom. 365 went up easy. I mean, the first few were okay. I was pretty happy with my performance on that. And uh, my elbows were sore that night from pushing this much weight. But I was really happy being able to push 365 with ease again. Last week, I wasn't getting that. And I said, you know what? Screw it. I think I'm going to go with 405. I feel good today. I need to get at least one of these. I haven't done it since I trained with Dusty Hanshaw. So I got on there. I took my tampon out. My blood was flowing everywhere. Slapped myself in the head. And I was like, I'm going to live this weight. I'm going to live this heavy ass weight. Hey, who ya? Hey. Got it, got it, got it. Boom. Getting it up like Ron Jeremy with a porn star. Look at that shit. Going right up. That, that, it's not over yet. My boy Morris helped me up. I had... I wanted to go to Hammer Strength. I'm going to pump these out. Just get a little blood flowing in there. Get used to the motion. Pump it out. Then I'm like, you know what? We need some bigger damn machines in this place. Because I'm going to just fill this shit up with plates. So I got it going on. And, um... Boom. I'll get as many as I can here. Drop set a little bit. See, rest pause and drop set. Can't really spot on this or else someone's gonna have their testicle all up on your, you know, midsection. So I have a partner here. We each take a side, pull it off. There's Van over there representing. He's still wearing the Converse, the Chuck Chuckies, the Chucky T's, the All Stars. Then I'm gonna go here, and you know I was exhausted at this point. My my titties were worn out, man. It was like they've been getting smacked all night. It was like I just had implants put in or gyno taken out. I don't know which one. This Van, he's been making some appearances in videos. I want you all to see Van. Van just had a kid um, this weekend. Congratulations, Van, and your lovely wife. And um, I was always under their seat. My brother had a good point once. Um, we were driving around. He said, you know what? You should really ask pregnant women on dates. And I said, why? He says, because you know they put out at least one time in their life. And he's got a point. So, Van, good job getting a wife who puts out. Very good. Look at that. He's pushing up. Now, I would have got him on incline bench, but Van has this, this way of before I start the camera starting his set. He's not used to being on film yet. So, we got to get him going on. I mean, he has that tattoo. And that too just says, I need to be filmed. So, we dropped him down. Now, Van is a strong motherfucker. He will keep up with me on leg day all day long. The guy is a freak. And he, uh, he just loves training. You're looking at a guy who has a very active job. And um, how we met is, is very funny. I had a barbecue at my house. I posted on Facebook that I'm um, having a barbecue. He said, do you, uh, do, you, do you want Facebook weirdos at your house? And I said, yeah, that's fine as long as you know Axe Marie. So I got to check my wife. She's pregnant. She hasn't killed anybody in a while. I think that's what he said or else I'm making it up. And regardless, we became good friends after that. And long story short, but here's him pushing this out. I mean, look at Van, dude. I mean, that shit, he's pushing. Look, I think I saw a hemorrhoid pop out. Look at that. Look between his legs. That's, that's, not, that's his hemorrhoid. That's not his package. Anyway, here. Now, all you fly freaks are going to go, Ow! You're not doing flies. You're doing press. Look, bitch. That ain't a press. If you notice, there's a slight bend in my arms. Yeah, okay. It's, it's bending a little bit. But look, it's 80 pounds, dude. My bicep attachment ain't strong. Speaking of which, my biceps for little girly biceps look pretty damn good there, I must say so myself. People call me out on arm day. What's wrong with you? Anyway, I just get a nice, good stretch for me. If you look at that, look, the, the, it's almost coming parallel to my chest there. I'm getting plenty of a stretch. If you look at Van, we got to give him this. If he starts like that heavier weight, he's going to tear his arm right off. But anyway, he just gets it done. I mean, Van is, Van is a man. Now, the thing about chest day, we kept it simple. We kept it stupid. And the thing is, with, with Dorian style, we didn't go too much. We did triceps as well, but we figured, you know what? We got y'all sexually stimulated enough with this, this chest workout that you really don't need to see triceps. And really, press downs, they're not that fucking interesting to watch. Anyway, you see here, coming up, these are honeys, all right? I'm feeling a stretch in my chest. Maybe I'm just not flexible. But all you guys saying there's a bench press, you know what? Just just keep your comments to yourself. Shut up. They feel they work for me to fly. My chest my best body part. Maybe I need to work more on something else. But, man, I'm loving this. Um... You know, uh, it feels good if you notice that shirt, some machine, machine training gear, it's available at TigerFitness.com. I'm going to kill it with this, this is the full stack right here, that's not saying much, not a very heavy machine, but I'm killing it here. You can tell the titties are just on fire right there. 
I mean, that's good. Look at look at my look at my beard. The beard is rocking it there. That looks painful. I should stop doing that to myself. Got a good stretch here. Look at that. Oh, I got it. Okay, I'm gonna drop this weight. I didn't know I was dropping it to, else I would have asked Van very politely to drop it for me. Now I'm gonna rep it out, dude. Oh shit, that's heavy. Why is it heavy? Because I'm tired. Because I'm tired of this workout. And you know what? Speaking of which, that's it. Peace out.